Hello YouTubers, it's your boy Buzz, and it is Friday, February 20th, and it's time for another episode of Where's Zur? That's right, the NPC that everyone loves to hate on Destiny. I've gone ahead and uh, run over to the tower uh, vault over there. I've grabbed all my strange coins. I've got my motes of light. And judging from uh, the traffic that's right in front of me, I'm going to assume that Zur is right in front of me. Anyway, love to hear what you guys thought of this week's Nightfall. I played through it once. I have three characters, and I normally play through all three, but I've got enough uh, stuff going on. Uh, in my life that I've got better things to do with 45 minutes of my time uh, than play through the Nightfall. So love to hear what your guys' thoughts were on it. I did post a video to my channel. Okay, so for this week, for Agent of the Nine, Zur, we have Crest of Alpha Loopy. We had this last week. Radiant Dance Machines for the Hunter. Uh, Void Fang Vestments for the Warlock. No Land Beyond. Horrific Sniper Rifle. Exotic Shard, we had that last week, but now the uh, Body Armor Ingram is back. The Exotic Ingram is back. Remember, we didn't have this last week. Down here in the 2.0 Upgrades, Knucklehead Radar, Acleophage Symbiote for the Hunter. Get the extra shot with the Golden Gun. An Insurmountable Skull Front, that's for the Titan. Crest of Alpha Loopy, once again for the Titan, Void Fang Vestments, Warlock, and Sunbreakers for the Warlock. Down in the Weapon 2.0 Upgrades, Plan C, Invective, The Last Word, Meta Multi Tool, Bad Juju, Hard Light, and Monte Carlo. Remember, for those of you who have never seen all this, uh, if you have some of the pre patch uh, exotics, you need to upgrade them so you can get up to the uh, higher. Uh, light ratings or higher damage outputs and notice down here in curios we have the elusive heavy ammo synthesis it is back thank god so now we don't have to run up to the uh, gunsmith and drop a thousand glimmer a shot for heavy ammo synthesis so we can go beat uh, uh, crota's ass but anyway it's also five of them for one strange coin which is great but down here we have auto rifle telemetry fusion rifle telemetry shotgun telemetry by the way if you don't know what you do you get a 30 minute timer you put those on you go do some farming and you can rank up your gun even faster over here the two useless upgrades emerald coil and void drive don't even waste your strange coins on these things to upgrade your sparrows because they're useless and over here for one strange coin you can get five heavy ammo synthesis so this is a welcome sight back onto um Zer's menu for the week up here for the exotics uh we've seen all these before none of these are really highly sought after uh they don't do anything in my opinion all that much i mean it's nice to see the exotic ingram back uh, and then these are just the standard uh, 2.0 upgrades. Now, uh, for this week, because I always give a grade for the weeks, based on what I see here as far as the exotics and what is down here as far as the curios, I'm not going to put it up here as far as uh, the 2.0 upgrades. Once again, Zer gets about a D. Nothing that's really highly sought after up here on the exotic gear. I mean, it's nice to see the exotic Ingrams back, but we've had those for weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks until last week, and then he decided not to bring it to us. This is the only thing that saved uh, Zer from getting an F uh, this week. The fact that heavy ammo synthesis is back. As soon as I get off this video, I'm probably going to load up on these things and throw them into the vault because I see nothing worth spending strange coins on in here. Anyway... If you want to leave a comment down below, tell me what you think of uh, my grade on Zero. It would be greatly appreciated. Remember for the channel, likes, comments, subs are loved. Until my next episode of Where's Zero, it's been your boy Buzz. Peace out.